What's going on, YouTube? I'm back. It's been a while. I'm Mr. Anonymous, and I'll see you all again. While I'm here today, it hasn't been a pay-per-view, well, besides UFC 124, but that's the story for another day. What I'm here for today is to talk about the uh, Slammies. We all know what the Slammies is. The Slammies is WWE's uh, award um, celebration for their... Um, What's the word I'm looking for? For all they've done in a span of a year. So I'm looking at the categories for tonight for this uh, for this award show. And I'm gonna be honest. I'm looking at half these nominations. I don't remember half of them, let alone one third. For example, for example, Shaka of the Year, the mayor's catching money in the bank. Remember that that just happens. Second nomination shock of the year, Randy Orton punts Jericho in the head. I don't even remember that. The Nexus debuts. Remember it, loved it. Paul Bear turns on the Undertaker. See that was son that was done so horribly bad that I just blocked it out of my memory banks. Knucklehead moment of the year. Big Show unmasks a ball Sam Punk. When I watch SmackDown and when they uh, show the uh, the package going into the show, they have that in the package. Big Show just unmasking Punk. So that's the only way I remember it. Santino Marella gets outdanced by Batman Claus Kozlov. I don't remember. Beth Phoenix eliminates the Great Khali from the Royal Rumble. She was in the Royal Rumble? Lay Cool gets beaten by Mae Young. Oh, that must have been that 3 hour Raw. I ain't watched that. I I'm sorry. I, I, I just won't. The Despicable Me Award. CM Punk sings Happy Birthday to Rey Mysterio's daughter. <laughs> I remember that because that was extremely funny. I could not help but just laugh or feel a little disturbed and I, I actually like it. Drew McIntyre, Drew McIntyre faces and humiliates Tay Long. Kane buries the Undertaker alive. Okay, that should have in parentheses with the help of Nexus. I'm just saying, just saying. Mr. Man makes truce with Bret Hart and kicks him in the groin. <sighs> Alright. The holy shit move of the year. Kofi Kingston hits Drew McIntyre with a leg drop off a ladder through the announce table. I don't remember it. I'm be honest. I remember Kofi jumping off the barricade in the audience on to Randy Orton. I don't remember the Drew McIntyre thing, I'm sorry. John Cena sends Batista onto a car through the stage with two attitude adjustments. What the hell? What was this? See this? Oh wow. Randy Orton delivers RKO to a flying effort board. I remember it and I loved it because that shit was just that was great timing on Randy Orton's part by the way. That was very done. That was done very well. John Morrison dies off the set onto Daniel Bryan in the Miz. When the hell was that? Uh, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Uh, when was this? Um. Oh. Um. No. No. Sorry. I I remember it in my head, but it's not coming out. Guest star shiny moment of the year. Oh, Wayne Bray gets RKO by Randy Orton. No, Pee Wee Herman versus The Miz. No, Mike Tyson punches out Chris Jericho. No, William Shatner sings Dodie interests, um, interests. Yeah, I do remember that because that was really funny. Oh, God, it's some long categories. Okay, the old snap meltdown of the year. Okay, I'm just going to run through this. Ah, uh, blah blah blah. Which one I will pick? I will pick, uh, just on what I remember. Wow, none of these actually are good. 
Moving on, that was the old snap moment of the year. WE moment of the year. Seamus attacks Triple H. Who is calling my phone? 